So we got quite a nice surprise today. Whoa! Those are the longest eggs I think I've ever seen. That is so weird. Yeah, so this is our speckled variety Cape Cobra. She was bred to a beautiful pastel yellow male. So there's definitely going to be some holdbacks there. You can see it's almost like a pinkish color. Those eggs are looking very good. She seems pretty calm with laying her eggs and all. Let's try and get this out a little further. Oh, sorry, girl. But yeah, I think she might be finished now, or there might be one more. We'll maybe take those eggs away from her. But yeah, those are beautiful eggs. Just weird that they're so long. Awesome stuff. Very cool to have captive bred Cape Cobras. We'll keep you guys posted when these little ones start hatching. Alrighty, so we're gonna steal these eggs. Now I'm filming and doing everything myself, which is obviously not ideal. So don't uh, do what I'm doing, anybody. But a lot of the time the Cape Cobras, well, a lot of snakes when they're laying eggs, they're very sort of like in a trance. Oh, these things are getting a little bit stuck to the bottom here. I'm glad we got them early. All right, girl. So um, we're not going to get these out of here easily. Being so sticky, they have stuck adhered to the bottom. And they will not survive here. There we go. I'm just going to pick those up. Pop them nicely in the position they found. Now she can easily sneak under that lid there now. Just get her turn a little more. She's actually very calm. Normally, she'd be hooding and going absolutely crazy. Yeah, so I'm literally just peeling this off from the base here. And it's just coming very slowly. If I go too quickly, I'm going to tear them because I can feel they're very, very thin. Very thin, leathery eggs. Okay, I am obviously watching her at all times. But yeah, it's quite amazing how snakes just go in this sort of trance. Here we go. Didn't go too bad. I must I mean those those are massively long eggs. Okay, so we've got six. And I think she is finished. Girl, let me touch you. Oh, it's amazing what sort of trance they're in. I mean, this is not. Uh, this is an extremely defensive snake normally. Okay, so that looks good. She looks pretty deflated and empty. She's just going to be wondering what happened to my eggs. All right, there we go. And hopefully we'll have some beautiful little babies soon. So it's that time. It's the 1st of Feb. And we've got our first little baby Cape Cobra out. And looking very, very nice and pale, which is good. A lot of time with the baby Cape Cobras, you can't really tell what color you're going to get at the end of the day. But uh, being this light, we should hopefully see these being nice pastel yellow like Dad. And uh, speckled varieties as well. Oh, don't strike, it's all on the defensive. So all the baby Cape Cobras have got that little black band on the throat. Or that dark brown band. 
then as they become adult they pretty much lose that but even dad has still actually got a very very faint like ghost band still but yeah being so light in color i'm pretty sure these are going to be amazing colored animals and uh yeah we're just going to hold on to them and wait and see so none of the other eggs have slit yet so what i'm going to do is probably just uh, make little portholes so these little guys can get out i'm just going to slice the egg because sometimes the egg tooth can fall off and then they can't get out and they'll actually suffocate and drown but yeah nice fat little baby this yeah little dude all right so on the defensive from young oh there we go also the band's also quite light across the throat so it should definitely be very pretty animals cool so i'll just cut these open so our little cape cobras are busy hatching we've got three out so far this one's still going to be coming out it's very very calm at the moment once they're out they can be a little more feisty but very very nice light colored animal this yeah so i just had this little guy out for photos uh, very very much on the defensive super hissy and everything but obviously being a little cobra spreading a hood to try and make himself look larger he's facing his attacker and striking out making a hissing noise that's his warning say back off leave me alone and uh, he was actually charging at me just now because he's obviously got no escape from this little photo booth he was really coming at me and uh, yeah, I was really giving it a go oh. but yeah you can see beautiful colors they've all shared now they all look pretty much the same it's not the best lighting it's a cell phone camera but yeah nice big fat healthy babies okay yeah so we don't want to tease him too much or anything that's our little baby cape cobras we've had very very cool always a pleasure to breed this species